Today, I'm going to show you how to use the Shape Builder tool in Adobe Illustrator. It's super handy for creating and editing shapes quickly. So, let's dive in. Let's locate the Shape Builder tool. You'll find it right here in the Tools bar. It looks like two circles with an arrow. You can also use the shortcut Shift plus M to activate it. All right, now that we've found it, let me show you the different modes it offers. Firstly, there's the Merge mode. Imagine you have two or three shapes overlapping, like these ones here. I am using three circles. Make sure to select all the shapes you want to merge before using the Shape Builder tool. Then, simply click and drag over them. They merge into one shape. Next, the Extraction mode. This lets you extract sections from overlapped shapes. For example, let's say I want to extract this leaf-like shape from these overlapping shapes. With all shapes selected, activate the Shape Builder tool. Then, just click on the section you want to extract. Let's talk about erasing or deleting shapes. Select the shapes you want to delete, then activate the Shape Builder tool. Hold down the Option or Alt key on your keyboard, and you'll see a minus symbol next to your cursor. Click on the sections you want to delete, and they're gone. Finally, my favorite trick with the Shape Builder tool is cleaning up overlapping strokes. Sometimes when you're drawing, lines overlap and things get messy. But not to worry, you can use the Shape Builder tool to clean them up. Just select all the strokes, activate the Shape Builder tool, and hold down Alt. Hover over the strokes, and you'll see them turn red. Click on the overlapping parts, and they disappear, leaving you with clean lines. And there you have it. You've just learned how to use the Shape Builder tool in less than 10 minutes. If you found this helpful, give the video a like and let me know in the comments what other tools you'd like me to cover. Have a fantastic day, and until next time, cheers!